Hello everyone. In this lecture, we will learn about sizing a water softener. First of all, we need to gather some design information. The first information is the water hardness, which is the level of calcium carbonate in the water. And this is measured in grains per gallon. And we know that one grain per gallon is equivalent to 17.14 ppm. This information is important for the conversion and the calculations later on. Also, we need to know what is the daily water consumption or the amount of water to be treated. Now, in order to know the water hardness, you can use a water hardness test kit or you can take a sample of your water to the laboratory. Now let's see an example in order to size a water softener. So we need to design a water softener for a building that has a daily consumption of 20,000 liters and a total hardness of 400 ppm. First of all, we need to adjust the daily consumption. Why? Because the softener has resin and the capacity of the resin can be quickly exhausted and we need to rinse this resin with a solution, with a salt solution. That's why we have to choose a regeneration cycle. And here we have chosen a cycle each or every two days. So every two days, we will have to rinse our resin with a salt solution. Therefore, the design flow rate will be doubled. So it will be times two. And we will design for 40,000 liters. Now we will convert it to gallons and we will get 10,568 gallons. Second, we, we, we need to convert the total hardness to grains per gallon. So we will divide 400 ppm by 17.14 and we will get 23.34 grains per gallon. Hence, in order to soften one gallon of water, we need 23.34 grains of resin. Third, we need to know the total number of grains. We will choose a safety factor of 1.2. Therefore, the softener capacity will be 10,568 times 23.34 grains of resin times the safety factor. And we will get the answer in grains. Now we can know the quantity of resin we, we need to soften our water. We know that each cubic foot of a typical high capacity resin can remove 30,000 grains. So the required quantity of resin will be the total number of grains divided by 30,000. So we need around 10, 10 cubic foot of resin to soften our water. 10, 10 cubic foot means 10 bags of resin. Now let's see how to choose the vessel and the brine tank in our case. We need to get a brochure from the manufacturer and we need to check the information in this sheet. I will go to the resin quantity that we have already designed. We need 10 cubic foot. So I will go to this range. And of course, we will choose 15 because it's more conservative. So we need a tank or a vessel that is 30 times 72 inches. And the brine tank will be 100 gallons. 